chapter Runaway Civilization. Runaway Civilization. Since the fall of the Atlantis about 23,000 year, years ago and until about 2012, the Earth was in a dark period uh, called the Age of Pisces. And since about 2012, the Earth moved to the period called the Age of Aquarius. The Age of Pisces was characterized by the fall of the vibration from the fourth density to the third density. There was high polarity, the loss of telepathy, and in this polarity, the humanity was developing under the big influence of the forces of darkness and the forces of light. Due to the loss of psychic abilities and telepathic abilities, the humans in this period were very confused and there was, there was much manipulation of human minds by the forces of darkness. And now the forces of darkness recede and the humanity awakens to its um, telepathic and psychic abilities. The Earth was never isolated from the surrounding star. In the Lemurian times, in the Atlantean times, and in all the times until now, and all the times since Atlantis, the Earth had been actively visited by extraterrestrial. The history of Earth was heavily affected by the developments in, of the, on the nearby stars. All the big stars you see in the sky are big because they are near. All big stars, including the Sun, are a part of, the, of our star cluster. Comment, what's the name of our star cluster? Although the archaeology clearly shows that uh, first biological species here, first complex biological species here were fish, then insects, then reptiles, then amphibians, then reptiles, and then mammals. It is not clear which of the highly sentient beings uh, have been here first. Was it insectoids, reptilians, or humans? Several respected sources uh, speak about the first founder race uh, to be feline humans or lyrans about half a billion years ago, in brackets, uh, 500 million which were peaceful and of high spiritual vibration. They colonized and seeded the life, uh, they seeded the intelligent life, sentient life on um, multiple planets and solar system and uh, other stars of our star cluster. At later time, there were draconians and reptilians. Ditch it, just say reptilians, no draconians. These were giant bipedal reptilians who lived on the main planet, a big planet called Maldek, located in the solar system between Mars and Jupiter. While Lyrans were peaceful, the reptilians were mi militant. They were very big because their planet was big, but when, when then their, their planet was destroyed and their descendants are smaller. Their descendants uh, still live now um, in smaller numbers in negative 4D, for density, and are still involved in, in man the manipulation of humans on Earth. The open manipulation, uh, the open presence of uh, open visit, uh, the visitation by the digit, the visitation by the aliens of the Earth was open in the ancient cultures, but more recently it became underground, became secret. The negative elite on the Earth, in brackets, cabal, is governed and uh, manipulated by the higher dimensional. A negative entity, a negative alien, which include reptilians, Nephilim, Orions, Nordics, and possibly artificial intelligence, uh, in brackets AI. Not, of the, not all of the above uh, races are negative. Uh, there are some factions in the, each of the races which are friendly to the humanity. There are some positive reptilians, positive Nordics, positive Orions, positive um, and positive others. In 1930s, before the World War II, the negative aliens shared their technologies with the German fascists, and this started the secret space program. 
in thirties and forties the uh, the Germans were able to build the space stations on Moon and Mars, and this became the beginning of the runaway civilization. After the end of the World War II and the defeat of Germans, the secret space program continued, and uh, the German and American military, and the survived factions of uh, German military and uh, new factions of American military secretly joined in this secret space program. The runaway civilization recruited humans from uh, many races on Earth as, as workers. Uh, developed the manufacturing facilities on Mars and uh, the stars of near, uh, nearby stars of our star cluster. And now this new human runaway civilization has millions of uh, workers and trades with 900 uh, civilizations of uh, all over the uh, galaxy and beyond. It still remains under control of negative aliens. This runaway civilization continues to take the resources, material resources and people from the earth and is responsible for the ongoing crisis, economic and uh, social crisis in the humanity. It has many alien technologies including uh, teleportation, mind control, free energy, uh, advanced uh, transportation, star travel, uh, use of stargates and creation of the portals, uh, time travel, time manipulation, uh, creation of uh, clones of the humans, uh, tra transportation of the souls, hy hybridization uh, of humans and other species. Yet this civilization uh, still is located in the 3D and can travel to 4D only for temporal for short periods of time, under two weeks. There are many crimes uh, which are done secretly done by the runaway civilization. The worst of it is the slave trade, then it is uh, the ecological crimes on earth, the manipulation of the humanity, the plan for uh, genocide in the humanity, genocide in the humanity, remove the plan for just, just genocide, uh, economical exploitation of the humanity, uh, mind control and disinformation. Many of the crimes against humanity are prevented, uh, restricted or limited by uh, positive extraterrestrials of higher dimension. The positive extraterrestrials uh, have stronger technologies and are assisted by angelic beings and the powers and consciousnesses of the creator level. Much of negativity is still permitted on earth because of the collective free will of the humanity. The laws of, of creation are uh, allow make a free will, make the free will the priority so if the humanity collectively wants the war and drama then uh, it is permitted yet there are powerful forces that make sure that humanity continues and the damage is only partial the total nuclear annihilation of the humanity has been prevented many times by uh, higher dimensional extra positive extraterrestrial in recent years around 2012 around 2014 there was a return of uh, the positive blue sphere alliance comprised of three times of three three types of beings sentient blue spheres blue avians and golden radiance this alliance has exceptionally powerful technologies and it established a quarantine around the solar system by surrounding the solar system with an energetic blue sphere which allows only positive and neutral beings to pass through the barrier. The negative aliens or humans are not permitted to uh, leave the solar system or come into the solar system. The hell by positive aliens and uh, neutral trade is still permitted. This radically changed our uh, situation to the better. The next positive steps towards the recovery of the humanity, the next steps towards the recovery of humanity are expected to be the disclosure where the humanity will learn about the aliens 
the open contact where the aliens would come uh, and visit openly the awakening when the humanity will realize the fact of the ascension and the process of the ascension so the humans individually can make a choice and the ascension the time frame for this for these events is not defined it is defined by the readiness of the humanity but the first event the disclosure can happen anytime because it can be triggered by um, the release of information to the public so the public might just get sufficient information to awaken to the presence of the extraterrestrial the, every year and even every month the idea of the presence of extraterrestrials is becomes more and more uh, the public knowledge and enters the more and more the mainstream um, understanding there are positive factions in uh, the secret space on different parts of secret space program this are uh, good people friendly to earth who want to assist the earth and um, help the earth to get rid of exploitation and uh, crimes of the secret space program so there are good people in the secret space program which intend to help one of them uh, most famous is the solar warden which is popularized by David Wilcock and Kerry Good. So this was a chapter on the runaway civilization for the book six um, by Max and Jim. Um, if you found the errors here, which I'm sure there are many errors, um, and if you have additional information which could improve this chapter, please uh, comment under the video or comment in the Facebook group, Hukula Facebook group, or uh, send me an email to max at humancolony.org. Uh, thank you.